Okay, we need phony credentials for us and fake release papers for Lulu. Maybe we should clear our daring rescue with the siblings of the blonde one? Why? Lucky will just have us arrested and Nicholas will send Lulu off to some castle in the middle of nowhere or something. But what, what if breaking her out of Shady Brook compromises her recovery? Do you really think she's getting better in there now? Spinelli, what if you were locked up in there and everything that made you my wonderful best friend was being therapied out of you? Wouldn't you want me to come save you? More than anything. I mean, I just want Lulu to come back so I can hate her and look really good at work compared to her. Don't you think breaking her out of Shady Brook is an extreme? She would do it for you if you were there. I mean, she would leave me to rot, but she would save you in a heartbeat. We need her. I need her. I kind of miss her. Please, Spinelli. If you're not fair, Lulu. Help is on the way. Uh. behavior of an unhinged inmate that... Spinelli, that's like really politically incorrect. I'm sorry. No, no, no. Come on. Don't worry. It's just us. Wow, just like that. Yeah, that Maximus dons the disguise of a reputable health specialist and I that of her trusty patient. <laughs> that's a very bad idea. Well, you're in no position to criticize. You should be grateful that we came here to rescue you. I'm sorry, you can't rescue me from this. Lulu, this is a blackmail note. How come you didn't tell someone? It's... I'm not being blackmailed. Hello, you killed Logan. You should pay. Somebody obviously believed you when you flipped out on the witness stand. Or maybe they knew all along. And maybe they know that I showed up right after you stabbed Logan no. in self-defense. Nobody knows. You should pay. Said payment would clearly be of a monetary nature. And while Lulu is not in and of herself wealthy, she is siblings with You don't persons. understand. Well, we'll have to this. find out who the blackmailer is first. Yeah, I will request assistance from Stone Cold. You don't need Jason's help because I am not being blackmailed. I wrote that note to myself. You most assuredly did not pen this threatening missive yourself. I, the analytical skills of Jack O'P.I. indicate that this is not your handwriting. It's happened before. What do you mean? I found a, a note on my tray, and when I went to show it to Johnny, it was gone. Okay, well that just proves someone's messing with your head. No. It means that I imagined it. Just like I imagined my mother's recovery and seeing Logan after he was dead. Okay, well, you're not imagining this note, Lulu, because Spinelli and I see it too. Wait, where did the fair one discover it? Under the book of poems that you left me. The fair one must know that the jackal would never attempt to undermine her sanity by placing threatening missives in and around books by Blake or the immortal bard. I wrote myself that note, and the scariest part is that I don't remember doing it. I'm getting worse. Well, you will be if you stay here. Which brings us back to our most pressing point, escape from Shady Brook. Oh, doctor. Well, go talk to him. What, what, what should I say? Anything. He'll believe you're a patient. Just distract him. Come on. Uh, yes? The jackal extends gracious greetings to the master of mental mysteries. Okay, as soon as Spinelli has the doctor distracted, we're going to make a break for it, and he'll just meet us outside. This is going to work like a charm. The Jackal has been often aware of the, the burdensome tension that exists between, you know, trusting one's own instincts and accepting the, the wisdom of others. You know, for throughout history, there's been a, a delicate balance between prophet and madman. <laughs> um, who is the Jackal? Oh, I am the Jackal, the assassin of the internet, ace of cyberspace, trusted minion of Stone Cold, and <laughs> more recently, the grasshopper of love. Third person delusion, nihilism, Observe for possible destructive I, I, tendencies. I must protest vehemently. We must, we must decry such labels, for there exists but a fragile wall between those who would wish to build the world up and those who would wish to watch it burn. No, 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 no. The faulty physician has made a most egregious mistake. The jackal is in, is in full command of his mental faculties. You, ah. <laughs>